Hello there guys! For today's video, I'm going to show you how to add hair using AI tool in Photoshop. And also, we will dive deeper into Lasso tool for making selection and generative fill. So let's get started! So here in our document, I prepare here an image of this man with a bald head. And our goal here is to apply a hair on his scalp. Alright, so the first step we're going to do here is we're going to create a selection on the top of the head of this man. So to do that, going on to the toolbar, let's go and find the lasso tool. All right, there you go. Click this one. Then for the options panel, I'm going to set this one to add to selection. All right, now we may now start creating a selection from the area of our subject where we want the hair will be. First, I'm going to create a selection to this. And by the way, if you find this video helpful so far, please consider subscribing to help YouTube algorithm show my videos to other nerds like us. Moving back, going on to our contextual taskbar. But if you can't find that, you can just go to the menu bar, go to Windows, and find the content taskbar on that part. All right, with this selection, let's go and hit generative fill. Now for the prompt, we'll be typing here. Or if you want to be specific, if you want to add a color to it, if you want to add a texture like curly hair on it, just type down on the prompt. All right. But for now, let's make it simple. Let's just add hair, then hit generate. Once done generating, AI Photoshop will give us three different variations. Okay. As you have noticed here that the hair is already applied to our subject. All right. Let's go to the contextual taskbar, or you can also go to the properties panel to check on the other variations okay yeah this one there we go let's check on the second variation okay now this one looks neat and clean okay and let's go to the third one and here's the third one okay so you can just choose the best for it okay so let's just select on the on the second one i prefer this kind of hair another thing try to give another example on applying hair to this image by applying a long hair to it Okay, so for now, I'm going to hide this hair layer. There you go. Then click on the background layer. Let's go and get the lasso tool once again. You can just press L for the shortcut key. Now for the selection, I'm going to extend the selection. Something like this. Okay, now once we already have this selection, go to the contextual taskbar, hit generate. Let's be specific this time. I want to say long hair or let's say long curly hair all right if you want to give it the color let's say comma and brown okay now hit generate and there you go this one looks amazing all right so now let's go and change now let's go and check on the other variation on the contextual taskbar all right so just click on this arrow moving to the right this is the second wow this looks so natural but I don't know what happened to the ear. So let's go and check the third one. Okay, the third one is also fine. It gives us a brown hair, a curly hair, and it's long. Okay, well, I go with this. And there you have it. Now let me show you the before and after. This one is the before. And this one is the after. And that is how to add hair using AI tool in Photoshop. 